TV for May 31st. I'm Dr. Serena Kelly. And I'm Dr. Catherine Vidura. So Catherine, you're just back from your trip and you promised to tell us all about it. Where did you go again? So the first stop was to the EU Asia Pacific Annual Conference, which was held in Macau. And this was a great success with a wide ranging number of presentations and in particular a number of sessions devoted just to postgraduate students who presented on their own research. So very interesting, um, very diverse from all the Asian countries which were represented and of course we got to see some of the sites of Macau with its Portuguese influence which was very interesting. And did you notice any sort of recurring themes in the conference presentations? Well, the conference itself was focused on the Euro crisis and the Eurozone crisis. So there were a number of um, presentations which spoke about the impact and influence that this financial crisis has had on some of the external activities of the European Union, particularly in the Asia region and also in the Australian and New Zealand context as well. And after, after Macau, I understand you jetted off to Geneva? Yes, um, I was fortunate enough to go together with Genevieve Taylor, also from the National Centre for Research on Europe, to Geneva for the UN platform for, on disaster risk reduction. And this included a delegation from New Zealand, as well as a high level of prominence from the European Union, with the Commissioner Kristalina Georgieva being present and giving a number of very well-informed um, and interesting presentations on disaster and some focus on small island states and of course New Zealand with its recent experience with earthquakes and the impact in the reconstruction and resilience phase was also quite present as was Japan interestingly too. So yes, a, a very interesting and intense four days with hopefully some important outcomes. So now on to other events. I understand that all the um, papers have now been accepted for the Canberra conference in September. And also, I believe that it is here in New Zealand, certainly in Christchurch, the last day of the university semester, so a lot of activities are wrapping up, but we still have a final seminar, and I believe, Serena, you will be hosting an interview. Yes, that's with Geoffrey Lean. He's from the Faculty of Law, well, Business and Law now, and he's, he's going to be um, speaking about the French burqa ban. So we look forward to hearing more about um, some of the relations between um, the, the French and the European systems as well in relation to that. Um, I believe that's the final of our events uh, for the moment. I understand as we're going to be on break from the university, it's probably timely to say that we will be seeing you again at the beginning of July when we start again with another round of EUCN events. So please stay tuned and we look forward to seeing you again at the beginning of July. Mm -hmm.